Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another day of our 12 days of Christmas. Today is day number 11 out of 12, which means Christmas is right around the corner, which means that I still have so much to do. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but I still have presents to wrap, I still have cookies to bake, holiday parties to attend, and I kind of love it. Like, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of love this holiday spirit that I'm in right now, and I thought it would be kind of fun to do something very, very different for my channel. And instead of talking about beauty today, I wanted to talk about what's in my bag. <laughs> I feel like you can get to know a person pretty well by knowing what's inside their handbag. Yesterday I went up to the city for the whole day and I have not yet unpacked my bag so I figured I would share with you the contents like real life what's inside of this guy um, and just have a little bit of fun with it. So with that being said I'm gonna jump on into what's in my bag and let's just get started. I'm just gonna start off with what's on top and kind of work my way down in this bottomless pit of a handbag and the first thing that I see is actually really really funny. So yesterday in the city we got this um, at like one of the stalls because it's gonna be a white elephant gift. Like I was saying earlier, we're going to a holiday party and we're doing a white elephant gift exchange. So for the white elephant as part of the gift, I spent $9 <laughs> on this, <laughs> on this hat. <laughs> okay, okay, these are all the rage in Korea right now and they have like these little guys and look, <laughs> I would totally put this on my head for the rest of the video, but this is like a gag gift to white elephant present for someone else, so I'm not gonna do that. But how funny is this? Everyone is wearing these around the city. It's ridiculous, but it's so awesome. So this is the first thing in my bag. We have this card case by Kate Spade. I love a good card case. Whether I'm using a big bag or a small bag, it's easily transportable between the two. I've got my credit card in here. I've got my identification. We have this tea money card, which is like the subway system card for Korea. We have a Starbucks gift card. We have this backup battery pack. Isn't it huge? It's like as big as my face. I love this because, well, first of all, my phone is always dying on me, um, but it's, I love the size of it. This thing, if I'm going on vacation or like away on a long weekend, um, it holds so much charge that I can continuously like recharge my cell phone um, or any other device for that matter for the entire week with like just one charge of this backup battery pack. So this one is like always, always with me. The next thing that I see, <laughs> okay, yesterday we went to a few breweries up in Seoul um, and so they were giving us some of these like coasters. So I have four coasters <laughs> from Seoul Brewery. It's like this new brewery up in the city. It was actually really, really cool. Their beer, if you're a beer person and you're in Seoul, was awesome. We all got different kinds, and I don't think that I tried one that I didn't like, which is really rare for a brewery. Uh, normally there's like an IPA or something that is just like not my cup of tea, but everything we tried was really good. Okay, next up we have a few receipts. I can't read them because they're in Korean. <laughs> um, so we have two receipts. What else do we have in here? So we have two of these little samples from Too Cool for School. It's their recovery balm. And then I also have two stickers <laughs> from Seoul Brewery as well. We have, I went to Too Cool for School, obviously, as you can see by those samples, and I picked up this. It said it was brand new. It's from their art class collection, and this is a quick dry brush cleansing tissue, which I think is very innovative and very inventive. Apparently, if you've ever seen like a color switch or something where you can just take your brush and like quickly get the color off, I think that's like the same idea as this, except it's supposed to clean your brush. So I'm really happy about that. If these actually work, this is gonna be awesome because I don't know about you guys, but I do not like cleaning my brushes at all. And then I also got a brush. Hopefully it's in here. This bag is like so like endless. So to go along with those brush cleansing tissues, I also got a brush from Tuple for School. This is their multi-blender brush, their artist brush, and I've heard really good things, so hopefully this is like a great duo that I picked up. Um, that's all that I picked up in Seoul yesterday, so the rest of this is just stuff that I brought with me. Um, I see another Starbucks gift card. <laughs> we have a, oh, I love this stuff. This is the Smith's Rosebud Solve. This has been a long time love of mine. You can get it at Sephora, it's like five or six dollars. And I always have this with me all the time, but especially in the winter. It's just like an all-in-one reparative salt. 
we're getting to the end, kind of. <laughs> I also have this little pouch inside. We just have my cash. So this is one and then some change in there. So this is what I was carrying yesterday to hold all of my like actual cash. It's funny because in America, I never carried cash on me ever. Uh, but in Korea, I always have to have some sort of cash just in case I need to fill my like subway card or get a train ticket um, or if I just want like some street food and they only take cash. So I always have a few thousand won. And then the last thing in this bag of tricks <laughs> is this pouch. I lied. It's this pouch and then there's also this little hair tie <laughs> and that is it. There's nothing left in this bag. So we have the hair tie, which obviously we always need hair ties all the time. And then this is like my little to go pouch. Similarly with my card holder that I just go from bag to bag to bag with, that's what I do with this as well. This just has a collection of lipsticks. We have my Chanel Mademoiselle lipstick. We have this MAC taupe lipstick. We have this Marc Jacobs High Shine Enamored Lip Gloss in Pretty Thing, my favorite gloss. Oh my gosh, we have a lot of lipsticks in here. <laughs> we have my Tom Ford Indian Rose Mini. Love that one. There's this Bite Beauty Agave Lip Mask in Maple, which is like the new love of my life. And then the last lippy in here is Chai by Bite. So we have six lipsticks. <laughs> Who needs all of that? I guess I do. <laughs> We have a pen in here because you always need a pen. Um, we have two of these fragrance samples, which I like to just spritz on through the day. So we have a mini of Another 13 by Le Labo, and also there is Rose 31 by Le Labo. Ooh, there's actually one more. It's the Raw Spirit Fragrances Wildfire. This one's such a beautiful, like, smoky scent. Really, really nice. And then the rest of this is just change. We have a few contacts in here. The worst thing in the world is when your contact rips on you and you have like no backups because I am like blind as a bat. And if I'm wearing contacts and one rips, I'm like completely out of luck. And randomly there's some earrings <laughs> and that's it. That's all that's in this little pouch and all that is in my bag. <laughs> so I hope that was fun. That's all the stuff that I was carrying around all day with me yesterday. Um, now that this is empty, I'm gonna go put it back on its little shelf and then put all this stuff away and then get to making all those Christmas cookies. <laughs> but yeah, I hope this was fun for you guys. It was fun for me. I hope you're having a great day or night wherever you are in the world and make sure to come back tomorrow for our last day of our 12 days of Christmas. All right guys, take care and I'll see you later. Bye.